Enfoco presents a photography exhibit at the Andrew Freeman home in the Bronx. The artists vary from a mixture of different cultures and have opportunity to have their work displayed in the public eye. The main goal of this event was to give appreciation to artists of color and encourage more to do the same. The purpose of my coming on was to make sure that Enfoco stays relevant, gets younger, relates to new audiences, and to hire the best possible people. Uh, Marisol Diaz next to me uh, was employed at Enfoco uh, for some time years ago and it was important to bring her on as someone who has a connection with Enfoco and, and she's worked closely with the staff that we have now. Well this particular exhibit focuses on young Bronx photographers and that's what you have here. You have five of them here, each equally different and unique and amazing in their own right. And I would say there are people that we need to keep an eye on because they are maturing at this moment, at this early stage, and good things are coming. So Enfoco basically um, helps to promote photographers of color. And, and what it does is it provides education, exhibitions, it publishes a magazine, Nueva Luz. But within the education component as a curator, I do have to talk to the artists about their work. So it's not just submitting work and putting the work up. It's actually going through every image and saying what's right and what can be improved and why is that the case. And also hearing from the artists about their feedback, what was their intention with their series, with their process. Because it, it is a give and take as a curator for me. That's how I function and that's how I was taught in Focal years ago. These artists each have their own background story associated with their work. Regardless of that, the artists want everyone to take a little something away from it, and each of them strive for that to be visualized through the photos. I, I don't want, I don't have something that, that I want them to take away. I just hope they enjoy it and hope they find a familiarity with the characters and with the subject and that it looks recognizable, like a typical, you know, home in New York, uptown, you know? So that's kind of, I wanted that uptown, um, familiar uh, vibe. Uh, just to um, basically um, help other people heal, you know. Um, if you're going through something, we're all going through something differently. Um, every statement of a, of a rib, every ribbon means something. So if you've been through it or you're going through it, I just hope my pictures can help you through your healing process if you even take a moment to see them. The event turned out to be a huge success and the photographers were honored to see their community come out and acknowledge their work. These photographers have all worked very hard to produce their final products to the Bronx community. And who knows, maybe one day they will pave a way for other artists of color not only to be recognized, but respected. This is Aaliyah Herndon for Bronxnet.